hello hopefuls and thanks so much for coming back to my channel so i have a very large or yeah large collective dollar tree haul this will probably be my last large dollar tree haul of 2019 this haul has some things that stocking stuffers some things that were on my wish list i've been holding on to since we went to trader joe's was it two weeks ago um also some things I already had to use like paint stuff and then some stuff for my class reunion which is on the 23rd of November and I have to go ahead and start working on this stuff because it's right around the corner today is what the 12th so yeah so this will be the last one and I'm putting myself on a $20 limit um, I would say $20 um, every two weeks no more than $40 a month and or less so if I go back, it'll be for, um, of course, like gift wrapping stuff, stocking stuffers. And I think it's two or three things that are on my wish list. The mason jar with the little red truck, if I ever find it. And the little swag berries. I think what it's, that's what it's called. If I can find it, I know my local Dollar Tree, I heard the lady say, the manager, they were slow at putting stuff out simply because... Why well, she said it was slow? Oh, they had a lot of Thanksgiving stuff to put out, like stuff like this. And she has to get that out in order to get the Christmas stuff out. And I'm trying to think what else, y'all. Um, yeah, I think that's it. Wish list stocking stuffers and, and gift wrap and stuff like that. But that's it. So let's get started. Okay, so I try to put this in some type of order. And I went in there looking, of course, for all the things that I've seen everyone hauling. And then I came across these placements. And I was like, ugh. Because you know you need at least four or six or whatever your place setting is. So let me turn down my lighting so you guys can see. So it has like a shimmer to it. And I found four of these placemats. And then in the ivory. Actually, they had plenty. So I could have got six. But I only got four. And then they had it in the hunt or the green and it has like a gold metallic and I like picking these up because you can use them for so many different things. I think years ago I got the turquoise, the, I don't remember the other color, but the red and it's another color and they came in so much in handy when I need to do like a little tablescape. And then I got four of the red so <laughs> when you see stuff like this you have to pick it up especially if you want an inexpensive um tablescape and my mom was like I took my mom was with me and I was like oh because I know it would be gone and I was like I have to get four of each one that's twelve dollars but anyway that's cheaper than buying a whole bunch of them and the quality does not look bad at all it looks really good Okay, moving along, I did want this tray that said it's the most wonderful time of the year. These will be really cute for a little party if you're having at home. And like if you're having like pancakes or cookies to lay out or something. And this tray was several cute ones, but I picked this one up. Have a cup of cheer. And all these correlate together with like the little cookie jars that... Or containers the stackable ones I think there's some mugs to that match and I'll make sure I link that haul above I went ahead and started picking up some stocking stuffers because usually the candy just like the Halloween candy the good candy good stuff gets gone quick so I did pick up the boys some now later apple the six pack here and then the candy canes where it says kool-aid and so it's tropical punch cherry and grape I also picked up two of the Lifesaver gummies. I don't know why I only picked up two. I should have picked up three. It shows a big kid. And the peppermint bark, I got this for teachers. So I first saw this one and I was like, I never seen that one before. But every year they always have this one. So these are really good gifts to give to coworkers, anybody really. Even if your kids like it or your spouse. But I got this for the teachers and I picked up three of those. The caramel peanut crisp clusters. I think I picked this up for Catrell, so that might be why I only picked up two of the gummies. 
I was on the hunt for the little red truck and I found it. And so I did pick up two of those. I was thinking about doing a DIY, but I was afraid. Uh, I probably won't mess it up, but I had to look for the little wooden pieces. I saw where Bargain Bethany did a really cute DIY on that. And then I got two of these bags where it says Merry Christmas. They can be like prop prompts props around the tree or if I want to use them of course as a gift I did go ahead and pick up the Reynolds pre-cut pop-up full sheets and you get 25 sheets in here for Thanksgiving or Christmas or whatever I saw this Dove men's care and I thought this would be really good for a stocking stuffer so I picked up three for all three of the dudes the big dudes and then also the cookies for Santa, this little plate. I wanted, you know how you just want to buy more than one. But I, of course, I didn't need only but one. And it's a saucer plate, so it's a small plate. I also picked up the this three-pack of aluminum plates. I picked these up before, from years before, to make like rolls and so forth. So um, that's what I picked up. So you can, I think it was iHeart recipe she had a recipe long time ago well not long time ago but a couple of years ago where she had the make ahead rolls and they were really good so i haven't decided if i'm gonna do those or not or just buy some but those are good to store i think she stored them in those okay i also wanted to pick up some of these gingerbread cookies yeah they're actually cookies i don't know if they have something in the middle or not and i have a idea of what i want to do with those i picked up four of those you get two in a you actually get four in a pack if they're not already stuck together i don't know and then i saw where they had a lot of frozen stuff but they also had like these coloring velvet poster sets so they come with markers and eight posters and i thought this would be really cute for christmas filler like gift for just like you know how you just pick up certain things that are inexpensive for a filler gift and then this one with Lion King they had a lot of um, frozen stuff but I don't have a little girl to give anything to even my sister and my um, niece or two outgrown that so that, that would have been good for a little girl I also got some foam craft this foam craft kit and I think I just got this to possibly help with my tablescape and if I don't need it, then just I would love to use this as a little craft. And then he picked out this little headband to wear with little elf ears. And then I thought this would be cute. He has not seen this, so he can wear this. He'll get a kick out of this. I passed up on some of the Kate Boss um, Kate kits. I was really excited to find to look for them and hunt for them. But when I saw it, I didn't get it. But then when I saw them and I was well, seeing them less and less i was like let me go ahead and grab it so i did grab the sports one because of course you know i have all boys and then the flower cake kit and you know you can use it for crafts so you don't necessarily have to use it for um or for cookies you don't have to use it for cakes so i thought that would be super cute and these are like some of the pieces the cookie cutter pieces that you get and then this right here, I think these are little trains or the car. Yeah, work truck set. I have to go back and look at some videos to see if it's more. But these are the only things I was able to see. And then this one here where it has the flower fondant rolling pin. I thought this will be really neat to work with. Or even with Play-Doh if you don't use it with anything like that for cakes. Okay, I also kept passing this up too and i finally picked it up the bakery little house so i think this was the only one that i didn't have i hope that i didn't have from last year i couldn't remember but i knew i didn't have the bakery and then i did find the little red truck cup and i just wanted the cup but i know you have to watch these cups because i recently had one i don't remember what was the design on it and water got in between the insulated part and I was like man that means I have to throw it away because you can't get the water out and then it's gonna mold and stuff but I thought it was cute for the season and then as well I got it's the most wonderful time of the year tumbler 
to make sure I get my water in. And then I picked up some makeup items and I have trying to experiment not experiment but find some really good i found a real good concealer and they stopped making it the mally and then now i have to find something that really works really well and also some makeup that works really really well for years i was using mary Kay, but anyway um i needed some more brushes and stuff and i've been eyeing this stuff for a while and i was like and i've been watching videos so i was like let me um pick this up so anyway I picked up this silicone facial mask applicator and I thought that would be neat to pick up I know when my mom used to sell it she used to do like she used to tell me to remember to do the mask and the mask would be um, I usually do a mask on Wednesday and the weekend so WW on W days okay I did not know what this was y'all until mama told me she knew exactly what it was and I was like I saw it been seeing it but I didn't know what it was so it's the shadow swatching sponge so like to kind of remove some of the color from your brush I'm sure you guys probably already knew that but I didn't even read it I was just like what is this and then she told me I thought this nail color was really pretty and I probably already have this one because you know they keep um, making similar ones so I don't know y'all I thought it was cute I did buy two other ones but I don't know where they are I went ahead and opened it I know it was a top coat and a rapid dry or top coat and base coat something like that but um, it's the pure ice but it peels really really quickly so I was disappointed in that I did pick up my niece the LA color nail polish and I should have picked her up another one with the little cute little nail file and that would be like part of adding to her Christmas so I don't know why I only picked up one maybe I'll find some more the contour brush I didn't have this one and then I did pick up finally the wet and wild large concealer brush the angle liner brush the large eyeshadow brush the contour brush and the crease brush I already have some brushes, but I just wanted some newer ones. I rarely, um, when I go somewhere, usually that's when I'll put more makeup on or whatever. But, yeah, I wanted, I've been watching videos, so that's why I decided to pick those up because I've been seeing them forever. I saw these headbands, the Ouchless headbands, and they are reversible. So I picked those up, and then I also saw these Lily Jane flower scrunchies. And these little pretty spring colors super cute and then as well I think mama saw these at a Dollar Tree and you get ten money envelopes I think eight that's pretty good and I probably have some from years before but I just didn't want to be short on those especially as the kids get older you know that's just all what they ask for I picked up some of these picks. Actually, I was looking for these picks over here for my class reunion. And then I was like, these are cute. And I was going to use them for my class reunion, but I love the ones that have like the faux snow on it. So I may end up using them, but I think I'm going to keep these for myself. And it was four of those. And if you like the picks like this, the really pretty ones, you have to grab those early. You can't wait like until after Thanksgiving or they're gone you know anyway they're gone okay so I did pick up two things above and I think I have a idea of what I want to do um, all this stuff right here is for my class reunion right here and I thought since it's so close to Christmas that I'll just go ahead and do a Christmas theme I was thinking about doing Thanksgiving but I waited too long to pick up flowers um, for last reunion i was like everybody being in the holiday spirit anyway so i just go ahead and do christmas these bugs they kind of give you like that burgundy color so i thought they would be perfect in gold that's what our class colors were anyway burgundy and gold maroon and gold and then i also you know my budget oh i didn't say that my budget was 30 dollars. i need to add up how much this is right here my budget for this is 30 dollars. no more <laughs> when you tend to do events sidebar y'all sorry when you tend to do events like this you try your best to stick to a budget I've learned because you will quickly quickly um, 
overspend and you're doing it free or you're doing it at a low cost so I have learned to make sure no matter how nice I want it to look and sometimes when people hear that it's from the Dollar Tree that they think that you can get all this stuff miraculously but dollars add up you can like some of the parties I have done they're still or things I've done from the Dollar Tree it'll be like a couple of hundred dollars or 50 or whatever you have to make sure not to go over budget because it's so easy to overspend and I am determined to see what I can do with $30 and this is what I have so far so just if you have started watching my channel because of those videos or anything like that just be careful not to overspend just to make it look a certain way because you end up cutting yourself um, cheating yourself undercutting yourself and that's not fair to you and you don't want it to leave a bad taste in your mouth because that is kind of what happened to me so just be careful of that stick to your budget and it is what it is <laughs> at the end of the day regardless of how nice you want it to look so to say all that y'all I picked up these picks with a little pine cone and these look they have the gold they have the burgundy of course I'm gonna fluff it out but I also picked up these picks when I saw with the little apple so I have an idea of these little faux apples that I want to get off of Amazon but they're like 10 12 dollars and I'm like I'm already at all close to my limit already so I'm really gonna think about if I'm gonna do that I think I have four of these picks so that's six seven eight nine ten dollars right there just in picks alone I meant to go to Michael's but I didn't because I've been trying not to go and usually when I'm on a tight budget I will make sure I catch a sale even Walmart will have flowers or whatever and I may use a couple of sprigs out of here so that's what I plan on doing like getting my I'm a sh I guess I share you guys what I'm gonna do and I'm gonna take some of these flowers and add them to here I don't know but I only picked up two of these I don't like how they're all mashed together but they'll be fine I did pick up two of these books these novels I don't even know what these books are about but it's for DIY and I do need to go to the thrift store I think the paperback books are 49 cents and get a couple of those so I don't lost count of where I'm at but let's see um yeah I lost count then I picked up some of these bells and I thought this would be cute to do like table scatter or something like that on the table I just love to add table scatter so I thought I would do that it's seven tables so if it's more than that we just short <laughs> we just short on that and then I picked up seven of these little goldfish bowls and I have a little idea of what I'm going to do with those so that's what I have thus far and yeah I could have did a whole lot more if I had more to work with but that's what my limit is going to be okay moving on when I went to the Dollar Tree looking for everything on my wish list I saw these little cute votive candle holders they are so pretty so they have like a little reindeer on them and I couldn't resist I had to get two of these and then I was happy to find these books for Saya. So these are the Seek and Find. And it's like a collection of four. And it is the North Pole. I cannot read through the lens. I don't know why I'm trying to do that. Christmas Time, the Nativity Story, the North Pole, and Winter Fun. And I really, guys, I really did not want to spend. That was easily $10 for Saya. But... You know, he's learning how to read and so forth, and they're going over sight words. And I just wanted to get him some Christmas books because a lot of times this year it's hard to get Christmas books in the library because everybody thinks ahead and plans to get them. I also, he loves little activity stuff like this. I guess he gets it from his mama. So the Christmas play pad jam packed with activities. I got him a little one. They had several different ones, but I didn't have time to flip to see if they were different. And then I probably will go back and get him a coloring book because he loves to color. He said it's relaxing, y'all. 
And so then I picked them up four of these little books here, The Perfect Christmas Tree. They're like a pop-up. And we'll probably put them in the living room so we can start reading them. I won't wait to Christmas to give them to them. The First Christmas Story, Noel the Reindeer, and then Christmas Countdown. Really cute. And let's see what the font looks like. So the font's not bad. It should be larger though, but not bad. I picked up some oven mitts to have oven mitts to have in the kitchen. You do have to wash these because they're not super thick. But I knew they would be red to go with my little color scheme. I did not find the buffalo check, so that's another thing that's on my wish list. Yeah, and I think that's it. The, the, the garland, the berry garland, the mason jar. Oh, I was looking for the apples, y'all, for this DIY. You know, the ceramic apples that I've been seeing, the different color ones, the gold, the red. But I cannot find them, so... I may try one more Dollar Tree, but again, I'm trying not to go over my budget. Then, um, these novelty glasses, I thought they would be cute. So, I got the Ranger one and also the Christmas tree one. I needed some more sanitizer. I hate that Dollar Tree went from two to three. I mean, from three to two. But, it is what it is. And then, these are really pretty. I was hoping are really cute. I was hoping to find the ones with the snow on it, but they did not have it. Somebody beat me to it, but these smell really, really good. And then lastly, I did get some of the wrapping paper, the buffalo check, and the ones with the cars on it. So I think that's it, y'all. I did have to get some stuff. I'm painting my dining room, and I did have to get stuff for that. I won't get a roller anymore. I done had two rollers pop on me. But the brush, the sponge part roller is just fine. You can't use it a, a long time along a big wall. But it works. I bought some drop cloths and some soap, some toilet paper, some nail polish, stuff like that that I already used. But guys, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the very next video. Bye-bye.